What's going on, y'all? I'm DJ Sean with the Charlotte Star Six, and in today's video, we going over Mrs. How Did He Not See Me, Miss Fake Out, Miss Shadow Clone Jutsu herself, probably one of the top operators in Siege, Yana. So in this video, I'm going to explain her loadout, when to use her hologram, going over using nades for frags instead of clearing utility, what an entry role is, and also giving you guys an example of some team pushes. So as usual in every video, if you stick around to the end, I show y'all in-game examples of me using her in rank. So be sure to stick around to the end to see that. And also, before we get started, I have a question of the day for y'all. So my question of the day this time is, who is your favorite entry fragger? Who is your favorite operator to push in and get those picks with? Who does it feel good to when you get a kill, you just start screaming like you in pro league? Let me know in the comments down below. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the Charlotte R6 channel. We would really appreciate it. But that is it. That is enough of me rambling. Let's get straight into this guy. All right, so real fast, we're going to get into our loadout. Look at this. Mm. And y'all seen Captain America, the Winter Soldier? Don't this remind you of Bucky right here? Well, before he got his life together. But this, this, is, this is basically the female version of Bucky right here. This is what we got. Super Soldier, ready for war. I forget what the number sequence was that made him lose his mind, but if I could remember those, I would say those too. But enough about that. So for her loadout, I don't really use the G36 on her in all honesty, because for one, I can't see anything all that well, and I need to see what it is I'm shooting at. So she only has the red dot, she got the ugly holographic, and she got a reflex. So none of these sites are for me. You know, I tried it out. I did horrible in the few games that I tried it out. I was like, this is not for me. So for the most part, I'm going to be using the ARX. So as you see, it has a 1.5 on it. I slapped a compensator on it because it feels better to me than when I was using the muzzle brake. So that's what I have on this gun. And y'all know from many videos I've done here that I am Mr. I can't control that recoil. So I use a vertical grip on that as well. So military grade weapon, you know, kickstart charm. I got to I got to go ahead and represent y'all know that all day. But that's what I want for the primary on her gun. So for the secondaries, the same thing as usual. It depends on how the team is playing and how I want to push things. But if people are going to play something with a shield, like they play heavy util with shields and stuff like that, I run the gun six to get rid of those. But if there's a team that's not really playing all that heavy with that type of util, I go ahead and slap the secondary on. She only has one secondary pistol besides the gun six, so not really much to talk about there. And for her gadget she has smoke grenades and frags now later on in this video you'll hear me say how you should use the frag grenades but if you're going for like kills and stuff like that or you're going to entry you can bring the nades if you're clearing util you can bring the nades and as usual if you're helping with the smoke plants or helping the plant go down and stuff like that playing more of a support role you can go ahead and slap the smokes on so that's pretty much what i run for her loadout i already showed y'all the fit that's it for the loadout portion. Now I'm going to get into how you should play her and what you should do. By the way, if you're enjoying this video so far, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. So one of the biggest things that it comes to when people are playing Yana is people get confused on when to use the hologram, when to draw out. So I'm going to help you differentiate between the two. So what I do when I use drones is I use drones for more like a setup thing, right? I'll set a drone up. Let's use Oregon, for example. I'll set a drone up, maybe looking at the stage, the rear stage area, or it depends on if we're pushing the front. Maybe I'll set a drone up Z hallway and then have another one looking at main stairs. So those two areas are watched by those drones. If somebody's upstairs and they flank down main, I'll be able to see them. If somebody flanks up white stairs, tries to get a few picks main lobby, I'll be able to see them there too. So drones are really used to me for setup phases. Now, when I drone out or use the hologram, I use it to figure out where people are. So if I'm pushing blue and a lot of the times people like to play elbow with a smoke with a shield or Jaeger ADSs or with my magnets, whatever the case may be, I use the drone to figure out what it is that's there and who's playing there. So I'll drone in or I'll hologram in and push actually into elbow with that hologram. And nine times out of 10, if there's a smoke there, or something like that i won't push it but it depends on what the team comp has with me so if there is a smoke there 
you'll be able to push it a lot of people rotate off but you can it's hard but you can push that so all you need is somebody with stuns and yana has the gone six so that can take care of the shield and you also have nades and that will get your pick so what i would do is have a nomad with you and a thermite with you and probably a maverick too so yana thermite maverick nomad and then the last person can be whatever so you can hologram in figure out who's playing elbow have the nomad air jab the blue doorway so you're not gonna be able to be pushed like that throw your stun grenades thermite has stuns so he can throw the stun grenades and elbow clear the magnets out or the ads's and then you can shoot the shield with your gone six or you can choose the nade to smoke whichever and there you go if gone perfectly you should be able to clear out elbow using that tactic so that's usually just one example i would use that hologram for and speaking of the grenades i touched a little bit on how you can use those to get frags too or clear utility like the shield but also if you're playing the map like theme park and there's something that you need to get off the wall not to the thing where you're pushing the throne room you might want to save your grenades for getting stuff off the wall compared to like trying to get a pick somewhere else on the map with those if that makes sense because if your maverick dies and usually people run a maverick on that map if your maverick dies his nades are gone you're the only one on the team unless there's a sledge or something like that that has grenades so depending on what your team cop is you don't want to get real antsy and just start throwing them nades everywhere you want to save those figure out what util you can get off the wall or clear from anywhere before you decide on how to get those picks because if you get a pick and there's still crazy amounts of util on the wall and your team can't push anything it was kind of like it, it's null and void like it defeats the purpose of you even getting that pick if you can't push anything afterwards so save your grenades be smart about those and you'll be a top tier yon so before we move on to the next part of the video really quick i want to give a shout out to today's video sponsor and that's root insurance with root insurance you can get a rate primarily based on how you drive good drivers can save up to 900 dollars a year with root so be sure to download the root app today and see how much you could be saving with root and you could save hundreds so be sure to get it but with that being said let's get back to the video so the next thing i want to touch on is being in the entry role yana is very good for being an entry for grand siege because the amount of intel you're going to be able to get from her using the hologram and she has grenades like i said but you want to be smart with them things of that nature she's very strong for that because there is something you could do with yana that a lot of operators can't do and sometimes it may work sometimes it may not you can fake it out that you're going to use a hologram like you can call it and people will hear it like it emits a noise when she, whenever she puts it out you can call it out they'll hear it but you can immediately put it away and you can swing and they might think that you're a fake that yana you may think you're they may think you're a fake yana i stumbled all over those words but you get what i'm saying one take drake they may think that you're a fake one and they might not shoot you depending on what elo you're in all right this tend to work more in lower elo than it does in higher elo but you could do the fake out and get those picks that way and also she's not really a heavy operator so me personally i like using operators that are fast that's how i am the best at getting my entry picks when i push in so she's not a heavy armor operator she has a great gun in the arx so when playing the entry role you have someone drone for you if you don't have someone droning for you that's what your hologram is for you can figure out where people are playing and you can push in and get those picks yourself so she excels very good at that so we went over when to use the hologram using your nades for util or frags depending on you being smart with them we explained a little bit about the entry role and how yana's good into it now as usual like i do in every video i am going to give y'all a few in-game examples that i've used her and it's worked in ranked so i'm gonna let this clip play and i will catch y'all when this around is over also another quick side note we have a team skin that's in the store right now that you can snatch up so be sure to check this out the skins are available for the r4c and the l8 so be sure to grab those up while you can because those skins that are in the store now won't be there for much longer so snatch them up hope y'all like them but with that let's get back to the video yeah They got that's a val that's Val's gun, ain't it? It sure is. One peek in the door, peek and master door, he's dead. 
I can get this shield over here. I did not mean to do that. Oh! You hate to see it. One's bit, uh, one's bed. Bunk beds by a big window. Tell them one close on the bridge. One close on bridge. He might be able to kill that guy breach now. I'm on breach. I don't know where he went. One was close on the breach, so if you peek that room, he might be in there. You see? I thought you see him. Yeah. No, he's he's behind that wall that you're looking at. Make noise on this wall. The the wall on the right. He's behind that wall. That's kid. He's dead. He's dead. You can plant. He's in kids. Just plant. Good job. Good job. You're in there, ain't no doubt about it. I'm in there. Uh, Rudy was outside. Girls. I have a drone here. She's not here. One ran towards drugs, so. Hey, that's the form I'll be coming. Can go for maintenance. We got one electrical. Two electrical clocks. Oh, you oh, hate fuck. to see it. C4 oh, two C4s. Two C4s. I got the wall, I got the wall, I got the wall. It's all good, it's all good. Uh, there's one in throne right now. He's hard right, I believe. Here, I'm gonna check with my drone. Hologram. Yeah, one throne. Back throne. Okay. Yo, anybody no, is there a hole in this wall? You got nade drone. Nade drone. Nade drone? Yeah, nade drone. Are we sure? He was on there. You, you, you called it. No, he was in the back. He was in the back. Yeah, that's that's that drone hole you can nade in and kill him if he's no there. Alka's still on pink four. Now oh, she moved, she moved. She's on this she's on pink four over here now. Oh, uh, the ADS. Oh, can we get do you have also? another do you have another thermite charge, Fox? Yeah, I do, I do. Come 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 maintenance. Come maintenance. I'm um, gonna maintenance both the other one. Yeah. Is it clear? Can I open? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Valk's on the right side. I'm a, I'm a hologram oh, this throw, box. Throw that, throw that, throw that. One on the, he's dead. He, this guy's down. There you go. Good yeah. job. I have Valk slumped on the end table. Mm. Oh my God. Whoever Yana skin this is ugly. All right, so that is it for me. Hopefully you guys learn from me explaining or me showing in-game examples of how you can use Yana and exactly how strong she is. She has a good gun. She has a good kit and all with the nades and the gone six, all that utility clear monster. So she is very good on entry, like I explained before. So hopefully she makes her way into your comps, into your team comps, if she's not in it already. So. As usual, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the Strial Star 6 channel. We really appreciate it. And also, while you're over there, you should check out what else we have for you. We got a bunch of guys on the channel. So go ahead, scroll through them, watch them, see what we got for y'all. We got some good stuff. So hopefully it helps y'all. And if you want to see more from me, you can check out my channel, namely my YouTube channel. All my socials are at DJSon. I got it up on the screen for you so you know how to spell it. I know I'll be mumbling sometimes and y'all can't really understand me. So there it is for you. And as usual, Astralis, thank you for having me. And I will catch y'all next time. Good luck on your ring games. Y'all gonna be great. Peace.